Antarctica, one of the largest land masses on the planet, an uninhabitable place where people do not live with the exception of researchers. What kind of life lives in the water surrounding this largely unexplored continent? Well, let's find out. Number 9. The Hourglass Dolphin Almost looks like a reverse killer whale, doesn't it? The hourglass dolphin is a small cetacean that lives in Antarctic waters that reaches a maximum length of 6 feet long. It gets its name from the hourglass markings on its sides. The hourglass dolphin is one of the only dolphin species that lives in the icy waters around Antarctica, and they are known for riding the waves created by ships and whales. The amount of dolphins in a pod can vary from 8 to 100 dolphins in a single group of these animals. Luckily for these marine mammals, they are not threatened by humans due to the fact that they live so remotely. In fact, there is known to be about 140,000 of these animals living in the waters of Antarctica. Number 8. Hoff crabs, also known as yeti crabs. Hoff crabs are very understudied crabs that live on hydrothermal vents near Antarctica. Their life on hydrothermal vents is very difficult because the water around them can be superheated to over 300 degrees Celsius. You heard me right, Celsius, not Fahrenheit, Celsius. The crabs have hairy chests and they use their hairy chests to essentially farm bacteria that they consume with their straining mouthparts. These crabs also have the nickname Yeti Crabs because of their hairy appearance. They look like a big hairy monster. In addition to this, the reason why they're called Hoff Crabs is because they're actually named after David Hasselhoff and his hairy chest. Kind of a weird but funny fact, but who knows? I mean, maybe this crab likes being named after a celebrity. Number 7. Giant Sea Spider This is a regular sea spider, and this is a giant sea spider next to a regular sea spider. The size difference is insane, and this creature indeed looks like an otherworldly being. The giant sea spider can grow to 30 centimeters in leg span, and to put that into perspective, that's about the size of a chihuahua. This arthropod is not an actual spider though, so don't worry. And if you're still scared of running into one of these things, it is very, very unlikely because they live 1800 meters or deeper below the surface. I mentioned before that they are not spiders, but they are also not crustaceans either. They belong to a specific family known as Pycnogonida, which only includes sea spiders. Sea spiders can have four to six pairs of legs, and as you can see, the Antarctic giant sea spider has five sets of legs. Interestingly enough, the major internal organs of a sea spider is found within its legs, so this animal really is all legs. The organism uses its proboscis to suck the insides out of the small, soft-bodied prey that it eats. Number 6. Leopard Seals Perhaps the most dangerous animal on the list to humans, leopard seals are an apex predator of the Antarctic waters. The animal is slender and reptilian-like in appearance. The animal has very long canines and sharply pointed molars, which is very unusual for seals, adding to the scare factor of this creature. Females are generally larger than males, and they can grow to over a thousand pounds in weight and over ten feet long. These seals have only one predator, and that is orcas. They are solitary hunters, and because of their solitary nature, it means that the biology behind this creature is still largely unknown. There's not much that these seals won't eat, as they consume fish, squid, penguins, and the occasional seal pup. It also has been noted that these seals tend to have taste preferences among different individuals. Some seals will hang out around crab eater seal pups, and some will hang out near penguin colonies. Kind of crazy that seals can have taste preferences. Number 5. The Macaroni Penguin. 
The macaroni penguin was actually named in the 18th century because in England, macaroni was a term used to describe a man that had a flamboyant style. Not because the penguin looks like a cheesy snack. The animal gets to be about 11 pounds and around 28 inches tall. The bird mainly feeds on krill, but it will occasionally eat squid and small fish. When these penguins go on dives, they can dive as deep as 330 feet and their dives can last about 2 minutes. These penguins, like most other penguin species, are very social and males are oftentimes aggressive towards other males. In the summertime in Antarctica, there can be macaroni penguin colonies as large as 100,000 individuals. The macaroni penguin is the most abundant species of penguin, however some populations of this species have declined by as much as 50% over the past four decades. A fun fact about these guys is that these guys hop around instead of waddling like most other penguin species. Number 4 Sea pigs. The Antarctic sea pig is a kind of sea cucumber that is found on the sea floor at around 400 to 900 meters deep. The sea pig gets its name because if you squint hard enough, the sea cucumber looks like, well, you guessed it, a pig. They are relatively simple organisms just sifting around through the sediment, consuming detritus. This deep sea species is also transparent. They are fairly common on the seafloor, but there is still much to learn from these strange creatures, such as why they give rides to king crabs sometimes. Do they do it for fun? Or are they being held hostage? I don't know. Number 3. The Antarctic Toothfish This fish is the largest fish in Antarctica and it is considered to be one of the top fish predators in Antarctica. They feed on lots of fish and squid, but they are also a prey item for sperm whales, seals, colossal squids, and orcas. They grow slowly and they live to be about 50 years in age. They are able to produce antifreeze proteins which prevent their blood from crystallizing. This fish can grow up to 2 meters long and about 300 pounds. Pretty large fish, don't you think? Number 2 Colossal Squid One of the largest invertebrates on the planet alive today, the Colossal Squid is an absolute unit. This squid has the largest eyes of any animal as well, with eyes the size of basketballs. It is found in the deep sea around Antarctica and this animal has only one predator, the sperm whale. The squid is very understudied due to the difficulty in finding live specimens and it is perhaps the largest animal on this list as it gets to 46 feet in length from the tip of its mantle to the tip of its feeding tentacles. The squid can reach weights of over 1100 pounds and that's twice the size of a bear. They have the largest beaks of any cephalopods and their tentacles have large hooks on them which are used in catching prey and defending against potential predators. The creature is thought to be a naturally occurring rare species. This animal is caught by accident as a result of the squid trying to take fishes caught from fishermen and they are found deeper than a thousand meters deep, which makes it very hard to observe live specimens. Before we get to number one on this list, I need something. If you're an ocean lover and you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything. Number one, the Antarctic scale worm. This is without a doubt the strangest creature that lives in Antarctica and also extreme nightmare fuel. Scale worms are found in the family Polynoidae, which includes many kinds of marine worms worldwide. This Antarctic scale worm is found at 500 meters below the surface on average, so don't worry, you couldn't really reach it even if you wanted to. Even if you got the chance to go to Antarctica, it'd be very unlikely that you would come across one of these. The scale worm gets its name from the scales that cover their bodies, which are often referred to as elytra. And no, not the elytra from Minecraft. This worm can get to lengths of more than 20 centimeters or almost 8 inches long, which is fairly large for a worm living at such a depth. To put that into perspective, this worm is the size of a squirrel. Not much is really known about this animal's feeding habits, although it is thought to live the lifestyle of an active hunter, which is pretty terrifying. 
This particular species of worm has a head that looks like a xenomorph from the movie Alien. And just like a xenomorph, it has a retractable proboscis that the worm uses to catch prey and then shred it to pieces. This is what you might see if you were an unlucky prey item for one of these worms. Pretty terrifying. Well, there you have it folks. That is nine of the craziest creatures that live in Antarctica's waters. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like and comment down below which one's your favorite.